Hi everyone, Basil Chapman here. This is the 11 o'clock Tiger Financial News Network market update. Dow's down 23 at 36,376. It really needs to just pop uh, one penny above the high of yesterday if today's a peak C early next week and then we get the D at above 36,678.44 one penny above we'll start that leg D and then I think we've got to be a bit careful again uh, nothing yet technically to say oh be careful but I am looking at a lot of daily charts in peak C, D and E and some even an F, and that just says, whoa, we could be getting closer to some kind of a consolidation. Well, I'm calling, talking about it will be a some kind of consolidation, and we'll see what happens. Look, the S&P made an all-time high yesterday. Uh, today, it's a little bit lower. It's a 260, uh, down 260 at 470, 4776, 21. Uh, we'll see what happens. And that's just a signal to say, hey, this is in the Chapman methodology. This is where you become a little bit careful. And you're looking at the QQQ, NDX 100. 398.84 down $1.53, not acting that well. And certainly the IWM, which is the Russell 2000, holding at a plus two cents, uh, 2.95, 2, 2 just hasn't done what you expect small caps to do at the end of the year. Uh, we were speaking a moment ago with one of our callers, and we were looking at the uh, IW, am I going to forget what it was? IWF, which is the... Uh, uh, well, well, no, IW, that's the 1000. IWV, I think it was. We were looking at the actually the Russell 3000, and that seems to be doing a little bit better. Yep, there it is. IWV, the Russell 3000, seems to be much, much better. It looks actually like the SP a little bit. So we're looking at selectivity. Gold tried to rally earlier on. It's still up eight and a half. Nice action. It's really just good action. It's not great yet, but it's good action. And looking at crude oil holding okay in the 76s and you've got the TLT just not telling us too much about bonds it is trying to rally some up 56 cents but the yields are really stuck in a range and that's kind of key that's really important so I am going to wish you all just a, a wonderful a wonderful weekend but a very happy New Year's to you all and a healthy one and a successful one you know here at TFNN we try our best to give our, our viewers our listeners our subscribers just the best we can and thank you to Tom O'Brien and the crew uh, for everything you do here at TFNN for us so that the hosts can just step in, do their thing, and then step out just the way it should be. And have a wonderful weekend. Uh, stay tuned. You've got programming coming up all day. And uh, hope to see you bright and breezy 2022.